Flotsam, you hear me? You hear, Reverend? Swanson! Howdy and yippee ki -yay -yay viewers. Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment, continuing on with my Red Dead Redemption 2 videos so far. This one is a video of the main character trying to find a member of the group who, well, He's a reverend, and he has a, well, kind of gambling and drinking problem. This is Who is Not Without Sin. Hello, sir. Swanson, you hear me? You hear, Reverend? Swanson! Come on. What's the hold up? Play your damn hand. Play it. All right. Wait. Mr. Morgan. I took your advice, sir. I took your advice. Then your god has finally deserted you. What you talking about? I took your advice, sir. I have removed myself from Morpheus's embrace. <laughs> No more shall I sink, sir. I am free. I am free. You don't seem free, friend. You seem drunk. Sit down, Reverend. We ain't finished. You ain't finished. Look at him. He's finished. None of us force liquor down his throat, friend. I just want him to play. Now, firstly, we ain't friends. Don't make no mistake on that subject. Now, secondly, he can't hardly see, let alone reason. Now, reasoning ain't never been one of my strong points, neither. But seeing, I do just fine. You want to step outside or deal with business here? I just want him to finish the game. Why can't we all just get along? These are good men, Arthur. They're children of God. They are children of God. Oh. Well, how's about you playing this place, huh? That seems fair. Fair? Sure. You want a game? Sure. I'll play a few hands. Well, sit yourself down then. Okay, the game is probably, I thought, going to be just five card, but turns out it's going to be Texas Hold'em, which I'm somewhat familiar with, and they deal out the cards to look at them, and I can take a look at the cards. Guy throws in a bet, I call or fold. Or raise the amount so I'm gonna call because at this point they're ace and ten and I actually got a solid hand so I might as well just again call now the other guy calls deal out the first couple of community cards and right there is a queen I've got nothing there but I still have a pretty solid hand. I'm gonna check. Whoa, queen 10, I thought it was an ace, but I got a pair, so that's good. Right now I'm starting out with a pair here, so I'm gonna check though, and then let this play through. Trying to have a little fun here. It is a game after all, mister. Well, someone's gotta raise it. Come on, at least make it interesting.
two pair. I'm guessing I have the game won unless someone can build a straight or do something to beat. Now it's 24 cents. Ooh, a lot of money. But I'm going to check, see who bets. And yeah, I've won. I have two pair and I've beat out the guy who has a pair and the other guy, he has two pair, but mine are higher. yippee ki yay I've won. And now to end the game. Gentlemen, this is getting too rich for me. Well, sit down. Oh, I'm done, friend. It's been a real education. Come on, Rip. Where is he? Where'd he go? Who? The Reverend. Where is... <sighs> Excuse me, gentlemen. The other guys, I'm guessing, aren't looking for violence, so now i got to find uh, Reverend Swanson, who's disappeared. And I'll talk to these strangers here and find out what happened. Excuse me, I'm sorry. You, you see a drunken idiot, a priest, wandering about? Sure, we saw him, smelt him, and avoided him. <laughs> he went that way, I think. Thanks. Yeah, I look kind of crazy, mister. Well, you have no idea. <laughs> You crazy? Great. Now I gotta find the Reverend. Hey, where are you, dude? Reverend. Oh, I'm over here. Help me. Oh, oh crap. Let's see what problems the guy has gotten himself into. Man, nah, it's gonna grab the horse. Nah, I can just come over here and find out what's going on with the reverend and run over here and it looks like someone's beating him up in the distance there so well i'm gonna have to fight the other guy you'll keep you stay out of it get your hands off him now you son of a bitch what the hell is your problem he's with me I was going to shoot the other guy, but now I accidentally killed him, and I got to confront the witness, catch up to the witness, and I've got nothing except a knife. And that, I got the sawed off shotgun here. And what do I decide to do? I'm going to try and loot the body because I'm an idiot, and the witness is running away, and I thought, well, up. Well, no, nope. failed. So guess what? I got to start at a retry checkpoint, and I guess I got to confront the witness. Can't let him escape. That's what sucks. Now that I know I got to confront the witness, uh, he's going to take off. Uh, I got the revolver back. He's a sheep herder, and I probably should shoot his sheep. But that would be mean. I'm going to shoot the poor dude anyway. Got to confront him. And he's making me chase him. Since I have to chase him, I'm going to, well, shoot him because I hate it when people make me chase them. And he's dead. Now, what? where's Reverend?
Now I got a chase after the Reverend who's wandered onto some railroad tracks. God, this game is somewhat unhumorous and a pain in the ass, which is why I may end up alternating between playing this game for a little bit and then some other games. This game is actually not a bad game overall. It's just irksome and problematic, and it's getting to a point where, to be honest with you, all this stuff is just driving me nuts. And you gotta help the Reverend. His foot's caught. And if you don't help him, you're gonna get run over by a train. And you gotta do this lever. And you gotta push this. And you gotta do that. And you gotta jiggle his foot and push. And yeah, here comes the train. And guess what? Yeah, we're dead. That is, again, one of the things I'll say is good about Red Dead Redemption. They give you a chance to start at a checkpoint, which is close to the event you need to handle. Now let's get this Reverend freed. But it appears to like this place and wants to stay. Get your foot out of here. Twist your leg, you drunken bastard. Help! Thank you, sir. Oh, 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 oh no, you don't. What the hell is wrong with you? What the hell is wrong with you? Throwing me off a bridge like there that? There was a goddamn train, you crazy bastard. <laughs> Have I been bad again, Mr. Morgan? I'm sorry. Uh, I wish I was different. Let's get you home. Home? Yeah, that's a wonderful idea. I could have tea with Margaret. Margaret? Who's Margaret? But. Flush of diamonds. Uh, what are you mumbling about now? And now, of course, you gotta bring the passed out drunken reverend back to camp, who is, I mean, the guy's a drunk. He's got a gambling problem. He's probably a charlatan. And, well, yeah, he's part of the crew. And you got to bring them back. And I'm going to fast forward because I don't want to waste all kinds of time and footage. It's a ride back. I was wondering when he'd show up. You 
better sleep your way to salvation, my friend. <laughs> oh, what happened? Just the usual. Poor <laughs> bastard. Exactly. Well, thank you, Mr. Morgan. I'll keep an eye on him. He was lucky this time. Real lucky. <laughs> Hi there, Arthur. And there you go. It is Who is Not Without Sin. The Reverend Swanson is back in camp, sleeping off his drunk. I'm Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment. Possibly going to do some more Red Dead Redemption 2 videos. If you like this video, hit the like button. If you like this type of video, I do four video game related videos a week. Maybe some non-video game related videos. The best way to find out is to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon and you will never miss out. They will, YouTube, send you a notification. I thank those people who are subscribing, and I thank those people who are writing some comments. Please leave some comments. I do my best to reply to all of them. I'm hoping to get 100 subscribers this year, and I thank everyone who's subscribed so far. And for those of you who just watched this video, Thanks for stopping by.